Hi, my name is Alex Cecilia. I'm going to show you how to make realistic street signs in Illustrator. So the first thing I'm going to start off with is the stop sign. And the way you can, uh, you're going to want to start by using the polygon tool. So go to your shape tool, which should probably look like that. Hold down the uh, button and select polygon tool and start drawing. If you hold down shift and you draw your polygon, um, it'll just make it exact. But first you want to figure out what shape you're doing. So I believe a stop sign is an octagon. So alright, so we need to go up to alright. So now we've got an octagon. I'm going to hold down shift and let go. So now we've got just the basic shape. So you're going to hold, uh, click that, select the right colors. Um, so we want red and white. And you're not going to be able to see the outline on the stop sign. So what I'd recommend um, just to you know keep better track of your shape and making sure you're doing it realistic enough just uh, draw a colored shape beneath it of a different color, of course. And pick a darker color than that. Okay. So this is still too thin, so I'm going to go ahead and make this bigger. All right, so there you've got. And now the stop in stop sign is a very basic font. It doesn't have any serifs on it or sans serifs. It's just um, it's it's just very basic. So I'm going to go ahead and use a font like Arial Black. In fact, um, you can even use I think Impact might work. That's better. Make sure it's white. And um, this font is kind of too small, so I'm going to go ahead and make it bigger to my liking. Because um, it goes up to one, to 72, but you can make it as big as you want. Um, that's good. All right, so there's your stop sign. And the trick, the trick behind any um, road sign or any sign is just to make sure you know what you're drawing because um, if for example if or make sure you've looked at you know your sign before you've actually made it so that it looks realistic enough um, and there you have your realistic road sign my name is Alex and this is how you create realistic road signs in Illustrator thank you